So this is what I bought from Tesco's tonight. Um, Handpicked with love, uh, £5 for roses and you get a selection. And then I've also bought this for a pound, this for a pound and this for a pound. So £3, £5, £8. And I'm going to show you the difference of what you can turn this into. Because a single rose, I think it was in Sainsbury's, was £3. A single rose in Tesco's was £2. This you can do yourself. I want to show you how to make, I'm laughing because this is proper cheats chocolate. So all I've done is I've gone and bought these. I've got the zesty orange, but if you see, I've already opened the package. I've got the silky milk chocolate smooth and velvety. That's Tesco's. Uh, it's only a pound a bar. I've got two bars of that. I'm going to do this one in a moment. I've got a Pyrex dish. I've put it in and then I'm now going to put that into the microwave and melt it. So that's been in the microwave for about a minute and a half. If I just give it a little stir. Okay, are you ready for the cheat? <laughs> Love this. So you get this. This I got from the range. Oh, excuse me, I think it's got a bit of flour on the back, back of it. I got this from the range. And then all you do is you pour in gently. I'm hoping I can do this while holding my phone at the same time. So there's one. You're going to shake them in a minute to make sure that there's no bubbles. There's two. Three. What you're going to do is you're actually going to bang, just bang lightly, this into place so that gets rid of all the air bubbles um, from this. Uh, you need to do it a little bit more than that and then you stick that <laughs> into the fridge and we're going to show you the outcome in just a minute. This is how your chocolates are going to turn out uh, and I am going to show you also how to wrap them. That's Frankie Jack huffing in the background because he can't find his last Valentine's chocolate but they're not these. <laughs> So that's how you make them. That's the cheats chocolate way and they're beautiful. This is how I've finished the little treat and I've wrapped them in tissue paper which I'm going to show you how to do right now. Um, this one I ran out of the red ribbon so I've just done pure red with a gold and I actually think I prefer it anyway. I think it looks more expensive. Um, so this is how to wrap then the chocolates and they, they look beautiful and it's only a little bit of tissue paper. You get 10 sheets for 99p. How I would wrap my chocolate. So I've got a piece of tissue paper. You get about 10 sheets for 99p in something like the card factory. And I've already cut them into what I consider to be a square. So you want them quite big. So I've probably cut about that much off the end. That's all. So let's take one at a time. <coughs> Excuse me. And you want to fold it in half. It doesn't matter which way. Fold it in half, fold it in half again, and then you've got to make sure that you get these sides that have been folded, so you go from, for the tip here and you fold it into a triangle, and then you fold it again into a triangle. Sorry, excuse the dogs. Shush, shush, shush. Fold it again into a triangle. So as you can see now, that's what you have. So taking the top and a pair of scissors, you're going to cut around like so. You see it's probably not equal because I'm doing it, trying to do it for the camera. There we go, that's better. Round like so. You want to throw that bit away. Move you a bit closer to me. And then, <clears throat> you're going to open that out. And we now have a flower. So, we're going to do that again. Because you want two pieces. Open this one up. 
Now you can do this with different colored tissue paper, which actually looks very nice, but I tried that this morning. I'll show you in just a moment, but I prefer the red um, because it's Valentine's. I've also got this really sweet ribbon that's got um, little love hearts on it. So I'm going to be tying a bow. So I'm going to cut that first so I don't make the mistake of not having it done ready for me. And then as I've been showing you, I have also made these cheats chocolate as i like to call them by the way this lovely dish is from the range so i'm going to take two love hearts and i'm going to take one of my orange which i made into a um circle and then i'm just going to bring that up like so i'm going to tie making sure i get it the right way around i'm going to tie this around here we are going to make a bow with the lovely love hearts and then I'm going to snip this out a little bit more and there we have your wrapped up chocolates now you could put cellophane over the top but I'm in a real rush I've done quite a few of these because that chocolate that I bought those three bars last night have made uh one two three four five six for seven people the flowers that I bought I think I got eight or twelve for a fiver so for eight pounds I could make a lot of people happy for Valentine's. <laughs> so it doesn't have to cost you a lot of money. So that's one, and I'm gonna go on to make the rest. Okay, so I want to show you how you can do this really easily. Because like I said, I bought a 12 pack of roses, red roses for five pounds at Valentine's at Tesco's. Um, and you can really easily do this yourself because one rose in Tesco's is two pounds. One rose in Sainsbury's is three pounds. You can buy 12 for five pounds and do the job yourself, which is exactly what I've done. So I've got a bit of cellophane um, for my roses. And what, I, oh, ow, 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 just putting myself with a thorn. Um, I've actually glittered the ends of these. You won't get them like that, although you can buy them, but they're more expensive. Now, if you want to see this, I'll show you in the description below. I've done it on some real uh, pink roses on another tutorial. So you can have a look at that tutorial. I'll leave your description below. So to, to save time, I'm just showing you that I've glittered these roses. Then I've taken cellophane, which I've just got from the range. I've got a really big, um, uh, reel of it the end part of the tissue paper that I use for the chocolates I've just cut off and I am now going to place that now I there's probably a much better way of doing this um, and probably somebody could teach me how to do it but this is how I I do it so I place the rose and then oh sorry that's the dog's going to the, the, the um somebody's at the door and then I twist this around making a cone shape so you gather the rose and you gather the, um, just push that down slightly, so you gather the rose and you gather the tissue paper and it's made into a slight cone. I'm now going to chop off what I don't want as neatly as possible because you don't want any frayed edges, otherwise it looks like it's handmade, doesn't it? Although some people love that, don't they? And then I've got my ribbon that I got from the range with the love hearts on. I would normally tie bows and for some, oh sugar, and for some of the other ribbon, the other roses that I've given out um, to girlfriends, etc. I would have, uh, I've done red ribbons on, but for this one, I've just gone and got this this morning from the range and I wanted to put love hearts on. So I'm just going, instead of doing a bow, I'm actually just going to tie it a knot because I think that looks the best with this. When you tie it in a bow, I don't know, it just doesn't hang the same. So then I am going to chop off the corners like so. 
and this one. So this is a really quick tutorial if you want to do for your girlfriend, your mom, your dad, your partner, whoever it is. Um, it's a really quick tutorial. And that, with those cheats, homemade chocolates, I think is just adorable. And I put the same ribbon on, so the same theme uh, goes through this. I'm going to be giving these to uh, friends of mine for Valentine's. Uh, to say how much I love them, those those of uh, them that have been there for me recently. Um, so that's how you do it. That's how quick and that's how simple it is. In at my gorgeous, I'm loving them. And this has only cost me. Remember, I've done I've done um, one, two, three, four, five, six. But this is for three people because you get chocolates and the rose. Don't forget, the chocolates cost me three pounds and the roses cost me a five. So for eight pounds. I could give seven girls and then five girls extra roses. And that's only co co cost me eight pounds. Um, obviously, the cellophane, the ribbon and the, the, the tissue paper I've already got in. The tissue paper is only, um, I think it's uh, 99 pence for 10 sheets. This only comes up about a five when you get reams and reams of it. Uh, the ribbon was a little bit more expensive from the range. I think that was about two pounds. <laughs> Wow, for four meters, but still really, really good. And um, we're going to have some happy souls. Remember, the glittering is in the description below, so I'll put it there. Give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to write your comments. But Valentine's today, a lot of people will be celebrating this weekend. So if you're looking for something to do for a loved one this weekend, if you're taking them away, etc., this could be for you. Quick, easy, and affordable. <laughs>